decided to base my piece on physical challenges. I chosen physical challenges because of the passion I have for children, working with children, volunteering to help children, engaging in activities with children, and in the future doctoring on children. Therefore, using common sense, you all can see that I'm really not into physical challenges. Today I will be informing you all about child abuse, the symptoms of child abuse, and also ways to prevent child abuse. Stop the abuse should be on every corner as the following, or something in relation to it. Why? Because even though less crimes or accidents are being reported today, according to Shirley O'Brien, author of Child Abuse, A Crime Shame, Conservative estimate and dedicate that 2 to 15 children die each day from physical abuse. What is child abuse? <coughs> According to the section of child abuse governing law and legislation by Avery J. Sloan, child abuse means the physical injury, sexual abuse, or maltreatment of a child under the age of 18 by a person who is irresponsible for the child that causes the child harm or threatens the child's life. These are pictures of the quote, children are our future, is true. Fantasia also song, I believe children are our future. And she also included in her song that you should teach them well and show them a way not to abuse them or beat them. Children don't know what they are doing at times or most times. Children <laughs> are not aware of physical, of physical abuse, nor do they understand why someone will hear them, hurt them, or cause them fear. Therefore, I will include you on the physical, the symptoms of physical abuse. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what are the symptoms of physical abuse? According to the publisher of Prevent Child Abuse America, or www.preventchildabuse.org, explains that burns, bruises, broken bones, black eyes, Cries and frightened when the child is about to go home. Shrinks at the approach of adults and has a history of child abuse, which is the parents have a history of child abuse. The golden rule, keep your hands, feet, and cigarettes to yourself. As you've seen on one of the pictures, the child was burned by their parents by a cigarette. <laughs> However, there are many ways to prevent child abuse. And one of the most important rules, mom, keep your hands, feet, and cigarettes to yourself. Parents getting involved and reaching out, being a friend to a parent that you may know, talk to your neighbors, and look out for one another child, which shows your care. Being a nurturing parent, if your baby cries, it can be frustrating. Therefore, learn what you are able to look for before it happens so you can be aware when your child cries instead of taking your frustration out on them. And last, promote programs in the, in the school, getting other parents involved. In conclusion, in conclusion, it was your choice. It would be your choice if you abuse your parent. If I mean abuse your child. As you may see, I inform you guys about what physical child abuse means, what are the symptoms, and also a way to prevent them. It's up to you whether you want to choose to do so and end up in jail. You can click the next side. That's why I have have your favorite stock prepared because you would be in there for a long time. <laughs>